Hello, good afternoon. Welcome to our show, The Real Talk, Pro na Wrong. Uh, okay guys, ang ating uh, panahin ngayon, ang ating maka-real talk ngayon, dati siyang DJ sa isang radio station dito sa CDO. Uh, isa rin siyang director ng isang indie film. Uh, galing pa nga siya na, ano, na guest ng isang ng isang nag, naging isang judge galing pa siya naging judge ngayon hindi na natin patatagalin pa let's welcome Mr. Cloyd Win Stanley hello hi Cloyd welcome hello. sa itong real talk welcome <laughs> welcome to my show welcome to my show <laughs> so hello everyone thank you for guesting me okay Cloyd uh, yeah. uh, can you tell us oh, English na ha mm, <laughs> Can you tell us the, uh, what do you mean, uh, the, the colorful, the colorful story of your life? What Think, color do you want? Uh, any kind, any color, rainbow color. Okay. Sige, once upon a time. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I'm Cloyd, I'm already 50 years old, I was born in 1973. And, uh... I was born in Dangtagan, Bukidnon. It's a very humble uh, story because I was born in a very, very uh, um, rural area in Bukidnon. Uh, so, uh, plenty of trees and uh, plenty of... Uh, it's mountainous. So, Dangtagan, Bukidnon. So, I was born there. I don't know why uh, they brought me there. My father was British. So, my father... Uh, I have... Half siblings. So, meron ako mga... I, I have half uh, siblings, half brothers and sisters. Uh, most of them are abroad. So, I so I did not grow up with my father. I, I grew up with my mama and my mommy. So, my mommy is my actually my lola. Uh -huh. So, my lola, but not my bi biological lola. Uh, she was uh, the a distant relative of my mother. So... Moto. So I was born, and then I was uh, after I was born, I, I was uh, brought here in Cagayan de Oro, and I was raised here. Uh, uh, I studied in Xavier University Grade School. So when I was in grade school, I I grew up in a very tough neighborhood. So we did not own a house ever since we just rented, and uh, every time I we we grew up, I grew up in a very tough neighborhood. So we were very poor actually. Uh, sometimes. What do you want? What do you want to ask me? <laughs> go. Uh, <laughs> go. Just go. Just go. So when I was when I was little, I remember na uh, we have our, our plates. Yung ang yung plato namin was plastic. So mm. yung plastic na very used, no. And then sometimes we, if we don't have viand, we call it viand here in the Philippines, but we don't. They, they don't have it in abroad. So sudan or ulam. So in in uh, in the Philippines we call it ulam. So ulam. Uh, sometimes you don't have ulam, no. So we just have rice, and then I experienced having ulam, uh, toyo og guan vinegar. Uh, so ka og toyo. So sometimes uh, Milo. No, we don't have uh, ulam. Sometimes powdered milk. So I enjoyed it because I was a I was a a kid, so I enjoyed it. Sometimes asukal. Oh, so there. And if we, once in a blue moon, we have corned beef. So I'm, it means like heaven kung makaulan kung corned beef ba. So, kung corned beef, really, wow. So, that's why, so that's why when, uh, when I had money, whenever I have money, uh, now, I'm, I'm, I'm grown already. So, I make it a point that I buy the most expensive corned beef. That's like 500, mm. 300, kay. One man, I, I was deprived of that before when I was a child. So, muna. And then my kids, I have three kids right now. Si River, um, the eldest, and the second is Casey, a girl. And then, gibali lang ang Casey, gihi mong CK, my, uh, my youngest is CK. So, four years old. Si Casey is eight years old. River is uh, seven, 17. So, mag, mag 18 si River. So, River, River's mommy is different. So, wala mm -hmm. may nakasal sa mommy. Uh, we did not uh, get married sa Mami in River. So, there. What else? I grew up in a very rough neighborhood. Uh, we transfer from house to house. Uh, so, uh, 
sometimes mga neighbors na mga bugoy no sa mga, mm. mga they were really tough you know the the bullies the you know um kan bitaw ng mamirahay the the girls the tough guys so so i grew up watching these uh kids and then i thought nga oh, okay the life is very tough so man, i grew up uh, really tough so when i was in high school uh i studied in Xavier University High School batch 90 but i did i did not graduate there and in, in uh, third year i went to COC Okay, di naman ko ganang school lam. Siya naman ko, you know, I I I don't want to go to school. I I wanna I wanna go to because we are we were all boys in in Xavier, so I got bored because we were all boys. I want I want to see girls. Nice. You know, I want I want to see women. So I went to girls' uh, schools like uh, Lourdes, like Corpus, uh, Saint Mary's. <laughs> so always come and classes to do that. No? To uh, because I want to talk to girls. So there, uh, what else? That's it. Asa sa ano, Cloyd, asa, di ba, uh, yung papa mo British, mm. tapos naka, uh, nakatira kayo sa Bukidnon? No, no, I was born in Bukidnon because ah. I was raised in Cagayan. Ah, okay. Oo. My dad, uh, when, when she met my mom, my dad was like 40 plus and my mom was like 20. So then I was born. I was conceived. I was born. So, uh, syempre, my dad had a a, a family. Ah, yeah. another family. One sila, kanang 12 sila kabuok. They were 12. So, most of my uh, siblings, half of my siblings do not want to acknowledge me. Half of them, they they accepted me. Mm. Uh, so, those who accepted me, we were friends. Hindi as, hindi ka ba, na, uh, hindi ka ba, nagtanim ng uh, galit kamote <laughs> hindi ka ba nagtanim ng galit sa <laughs> ng galit na uh, that's a very oh, cool ang daddy mo really uh, no my my dad we were very good friends with my dad kasi my, my dad used to visit me all the time no? mm. my dad visits me all the british siya akong dad but he was a naturalized filipino and then he entered into politics ah, okay. so when he entered into politics he was very close with uh, ferdinand marcos senior mm. So, Crony ito siya. He was a uh, Marcos Crony. And then, it came to a point na he was murdered because of that. No? So, he was murdered. I was uh, in grade 5 when that happened. So, I didn't know, okay, one more, what, oh, what happened? What happened? So, after how many years, so, uh, there there were uh, a lot of versions, anti versions na, oh, your dad was killed because of this, your dad was killed mm. because of that. So, I didn't, I didn't bother na to kuan gidu, kung sa ang truth, no? Okay. One man. It's very complicated. The truth mm. is very complicated. Especially nga, it's politics. You know, it involves Marcos and all. So, moto, uh, moto, I, I, uh, we, we went on living. Ako. So, it, it, it was, it has always been at me, my mama, and my mommy. So, tulong ka sa isa kabalay. So, naging high school ka, balita-balita ha, mm. na marami kang chicks. <laughs> Oh, really? I, I'm a very uh, good person. <laughs> yung, yung ano, sa, uh, hindi naman yung, mga in, ano, uh, sa high school na maraming shota, ganyan. When I was in high school, I, of course, motong ingon nga, magdating classes ko, I, I go to other girls' schools to talk to girls. Kay, mm. I was bored in my school, nga, puro mi boys, gani. So I was like, uh, I, I always go to Lourdes, I always go to Corpus, I always go to St. Mary. So, there are mga guapa dia, no? We have sister class uh, in, in Xavier. Sister class meaning all boys and Xavier, all girls and Lourdes. So, mm. mananghid mi sa among uh, isig ka principal. Uh, can we have a sister class? Can, can we have an activity where we can, you know, mingle and meet girls? So, there is a time. But bro, that only happens like once a year or twice a year. So, every Christmas or, you know. So, me, I want to talk to girls every day. So, I, I sometimes I go there. Uh, almost every afternoon, I go to uh, girls' uh, campuses. So, why not? And then, moto. Uh, it was just like, Murag, crush, crush, puppy love. I want to talk to you. I want to hold, I want to hold your hand. No, it's not, nothing serious. Okay. In the 80s, it's it's not like in the in today, in 2024, Ang mga bata, naroon like, 
uh, can you be my girlfriend? Sure. Okay, let's meet. Mm -hmm. Let's date. We, we don't have that in, in 1980s. the 1980s. You have to talk to a girl. You have to go to the house. Uh, hi, is uh, Miss So and So there? Is uh, for example, uh, uh, is Alana there or is Aliona there or is Karen or Christine there? So, so and then the father was like, oh, "What's your name? Who are you? Where are you mm -hmm. from? Okay, sit down. Okay, my daughter will come out. So, I mean, we talk right inside the house." Right now, it's very dangerous or it's very complicated or I don't like it now, okay? Like you text or mag message lang mo, like Magkita tayo doon. You don't even know the person. Yeah. And can, can we see each other? So, okay, I love you. Okay, mm -hmm. I love you too. You don't even know that person. So, <laughs> so it's different now. So, sa, pag, uh, sa pagdating mo ng college, uh, siguro na, doon na yung seryoso mo uh, when, I to, when I went to college, uh, I went to college very late, no? So, I'm, I'm not really serious. Uh, I had a very serious relationship for the first time. Casing uh, Army. <laughs> so, her name, I didn't really mention her name. No, it's okay. We will not mention her name is Shari. <laughs> I mean, you know, hello, Shari. So, uh, Shari is a very, very good Christian. You know, she introduced me to uh, the Christian life. So I was like, well, what is this? So I was like, serious. But it didn't work out after a few months, uh, almost a year. It didn't work out. So after that, uh, I had a series of, you know, si serious, non-serious, serious, non-serious. So I uh, lang. until, yeah, it, 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 went, it went like that. Uh, and in, in so many years, so many years, mga serious, non serious. So, people think na, ah, si Kenny, si Cloyd, kay Playboy, kay ni, kay kwa. I'm always associated with women, kay I'm a DJ, mm. and then siempre ang women kay ah, kana fans kis lay, like, can we take a picture or you know, uh, can we can we go to your radio station and listen to you talk? I was like, sure. So, marami mga baba inside the booth, outside the booth, they're waiting. So, I'm always associated with. Girls, pero di lang lugar ingon nga. Ah, uya bunta ka or you, you my girlfriend, you, you, you. But it, at some point, it, <laughs> siguro it, uh, it really happened. Kano mga nana na ito? Di lang siya, di lang siya malikayan nga. I have a girlfriend. Mm. Okay, so and then there's just somebody flirting. You know, so I was young, so I was like, okay, sure, I'm young and single. Cool, I have two girlfriends. <laughs> so, <laughs> so nana, it, it happened, no? So that that was a long time ago, so. There, ang kagayan kay dili pa man kaayo inana ka modern. No? So, wala pa cell phone. So, mm. if you date somebody here, you can date somebody <laughs> right now. You can be just, you know, somebody will photograph you. Hey, your boyfriend is here dating somebody else. So, uh, but I don't do that now, okay? I'm married already. Hindi ka ba natatakot nung kabataan mo na... Hindi, uh, yung iba kasi... Uh... Sabi nila hindi ako mag hindi ko paglaruan yung babae kasi may kapatid ako, may mama ako. Um yeah, it came to a point like that na uh, what if I will have a daughter? You know? mm. So when my daughter was born, I was like, "Whoa, wait a second. <laughs> I have a daughter now." So but before my daughter was born, uh, it was my personal choice nga to lay low. You no, know? it was my pers the 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 reason why I laid low was really uh, actually very, uh, it's not weird, but it's practical. No, It's not that, okay, I realize something that, you know, uh, because I'm, I'm a Christian now. No, it's, if you're a Christian, you're always tempted. Mm. No, it's, So it's not a, a, a choice that I'm a Christian, I should stop everything, no? womanizing and stuff. It, it, I, I decided to stop. Why? Kaya nagkalat ang AIDS sa kagayan. So I was like, wait a second, I have to stop. <laughs> I have to stop at one point because nanay mga HIV positive like uh, 20 plus in, in kagayan di oras. It's scary. Mm. It's, it's scary and it's growing. And it's mostly, uh, it's either the LGBT or young women. So I have to stop. So uh, it came to a point I decided, no, I should have just one girlfriend and I should just be loyal and I should just uh, you know, stick to that girlfriend. I will not be promiscuous anymore. So it happened. So I met this girl. So I was like, okay, you, you will be my... And she was very young. She was 19 years old when I met her. 
So I was like, you, you will be my girlfriend, okay? Nobody else. You don't have any boyfriend. I don't have any girlfriend. So, so we decided to be, we decided to be like that. And then she got pregnant. So, and then we got married. Mm. So we got married. Uh, civil. The, 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 the crazy thing about our marriage. Yun yung pangalawa mong... Oh, oh. Dili, siya, dili siya pangalawa, but that's, ah, that's, oh, that's the, the girl I got married with. Ah. Ang mommy ni River, I, I met the mommy of River, uh, oh, classmate ni Arnie, I think batchmate ba mo? Were you batchmates? Oh. Uh, so, I, I met her, but we were, we were very, uh, you know, I was really disturbed that time. So, I, I met her, and then I met her in Cebu, and then I got her pregnant. But it didn't, it didn't work out, so we just uh, remained friends. So I, I told her, and we just, uh, uh, we have to remain friends uh, for my, for our son, si River. So River turned out nga, actually si River, wala nang nagdahong nga autistic si River until he was four years old. So, mm. uh, he had a billboard because he, he, River is really handsome, no? And then he had a photo shoot. Uh, for a billboard for Plaza Fair, mm -hmm. and then another brand, uh, Rain or Shine paint. So, so we uh, noticed that si River he doesn't like the camera. He doesn't look at the camera. He doesn't look mm -hmm. at people. So it's very hard. And then he has tantrums. So it's really hard for River to be mo a model, no? So we decided to have her ha have him check as a doctor, and then we found out that that's a mild autism. So, ah, okay. So when we found out, okay, sige. So uh, we sent him to therapy. So uh, Apo and the mother of River, so we work hand in hand for River's sake, no? Until at such a point nga, uh, we decided to part ways. So uh, he went on with her life. And then I went on with, uh, went on with mine. And then I met kini akong wife. Lagi. I, uh, it was accidental because I just wanted her to be my girlfriend. You just be my girlfriend, okay? Then... Uh, because I have a son, so just be my girlfriend. And then, uh, ang term at the time ke exclusively dating. So mm. we, we should be exclusively dating, okay? I will not date any other girls. You don't Shana. date any other boys. So we did that for some time. But she got pregnant, and then uh, we decided to get married. Our wedding was not really pleasant. It's, it was terrible. It was uh, kumbaga, um, traumatic. For her and for me, okay. The day before our wed, our supposedly wedding, civil wedding, I had an accident. Nahit anran ko ba? So somebody bumped me. So I told Arnie about this. I was riding a motorcycle. So and then nakahasard pagi ko, nagahasard ko ba? So somebody, maybe a drunk guy, he bumped into me and then at ni ni lupad ko, I flew. No, so I went, I uh, went to the ground. All I can yell was Jesus. So, but nothing happened. Grapika miracle. Nothing happened to me, no? So, uh, no broken bone. Grapika miracle. No fracture, no nothing. Just scratches. So, when I went to the hospital, I injected it with the anti-tetanus and that's it. So, and then I went home. Grapika miracle. It's a, it was a miracle. So, on the day, uh, that was the night before my wedding. So, on the day of my wedding, I was in the hospital. So, I told them that, Let's just postpone the wedding. Mm. Anyway, one. Anyway, it's just kind civil. We just no, po hindi naman siya ma-postpone. Pero the mom of my uh, my wife, my girlfriend back then, kib pregnant tama ng gurgi ako wife. Dapat mm. tigtian, no? She went there with the judge. <laughs> wait a second. Oh, wait a second. I'm not dying. <laughs> we can do this some other time. Mm. So the judge was like, "Okay, what do you want to do?" I was like, "Okay, since you're here, so see so yeah, you. Let's just." So it was very traumatic for my mm. my wife. Okay. Uh, she did not expect it to be like that. Mm. It's supposed to be happy. Yes. So she was crying you know, while while what? So there, it was not pleasant. So mula abun permi awayan na you know we, we didn't have a really uh, perfect wedding and and stuff like that. I was like yeah because there's circumstances mong good nga pan. Hindi naman sinasadya yung. Oh so there. So now we have two kids. A uh, boy and a girl. Who is Cloyd before? Mm -hmm. and in after? high school, in high school and in college. So in high school, uh, balik tasa grade school. So when I was in grade school, I was there are the diligent na malikayan there are bullies, no? So naay mga bullies in school. So they bully 
actually those uh, students or uh, kids nga mga the small ones or the weak ones so believe it or not I was a big guy I was tall so that also bullies nga, mm. there, there are also people who bully me the the only thing was when somebody bullies me when I was in grade school I always pick up a fight ah okay so you're a bully bang so 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 bagay so all my bullies I beat up all my bullies even uh, there was one time even uh, at, at one time in front of my teacher mm. I, I cannot forget that day I I beat up ikulata na ako ang isa ka bully in front of my teacher my teacher like why are you no? so ina na ako ka barumbado no because I grew up in a very tough neighborhood na and like some bagay mm. nini na nagpatay ako so I think so I thought that was normal mm. no? in high school same thing okay all boys man is some bagay in in grade school mag, uh, in high school mag ni Xavier all boys man ni there are also gays in our uh, class lugar pero just like two or three one or two ano. so in all boys man ni when for example if I pick up fight like smaga ah huh? smagay ta let's let's fight okay sure let's fight okay later let's fight so inana that's our like uh, pastime fighting oh, wala ako may cellphone there's no cellphones oh. there. there's no internet there's no Facebook so what we do is we fight. Okay, you and me, we fight later. So, inana, inana, make all boys. So, uh, there in college, not so much na. Pero in college, nadala na po na ako pag uh, hot headed, no? Ako pag uh, kanang tao nila barbado. So I was people call me before the bad boy radio. <laughs> okay, bad boy Bakit kiko. Bad boy. Bad boy kiko kay kanang rugged na ako. Number one, rugged na ako look. I don't, I don't comb my hair. I don't mm. sometimes no shade. And yeah, ang ako, I, I wear like kanang mga gisik gisik, uh, tattered jeans and then boots and then I walk like in a manner nga ko and so. But the girls like it. Mm. <laughs> I drive a, a muscle car, a Camaro, a 1969 Camaro. So people are like, whoa, it's a, like it's a different personality. Like, uh, most of the girls like it, no? Nga minana nga a tough guy look, so bad boy. So, Ilana, there's there was a time that I carry a gun. I, I had death threats mm. before I had death threats. So I carry a gun. It's a licensed gun, but un, not under my name. Ako oh. nagyapo tungi uli sa kwan sa tagiya. No, the the my friend who's a Maranao. So he said me, okay, keep this gun for now. I was like, okay, sure. So, but the license was his. So there, but uh, I, I returned that gun to him after a few months. So in Arab, bad boy guy, you know. And then, pwede ko kitag away, ganang hot-headed, ganang. I have a very short temper, a very short fuse. Okay, so I had a very short fuse. Like, for example, uh, if uh, na ay kasagana traffic, no. Some some people, they, they cut me off, uh, drive a uh, drive my car, and then na ay mo cut off, wali, munaog ko, ano. I, I yell obscenities. Let's fight. So, in ako before, I uh, na overcome na ko, no? uh, If somebody cuts me off, if somebody like mag counter flow, or if somebody like, yells at me, some, sometimes even. Did man lang. Sometimes even mag motor ko karon. Uh, like, uh, like there's a there's a motorcycle or a. Uh, uh, a car na will pass by and ma- mm. managsikan mo na all the mud will be, you know, in me. I will not just, I, I'll just be calm. So, na overcome mo na, I'll just be calm and then, I will not yell anything, I will not yell obscenities, I will, I will not look for a fight like, hey, you. So, dili na, I was like, okay, it happened. <laughs> so, inana na, so, inana na, kalma karon. And then, what else? Uh, that was, before, I was really the worst, no? Uh, even my mom, even my ex-girlfriends, even my uh, my lola, my mommy, they don't like who I was before. Mm. But they have gida mukunila they accept me for who I was. But they don't like it nga I'm very hot-headed and very ill-tempered, nga very short fuse. Pero karon I'm just very calm. Pagdating sa girls, okay. yeah. girls na po na balik na po na mm. Pagdating sa girls. May, may ano, uh, mm. yung ibang lalaki kasi pagdating sa babae mm. na 
uh, dinadala nila kahit saan. Mm. Uh, kung anong... Yun ang yung gawain ng girlfriend and boyfriend. Uh, you really wanna know? <laughs> Slight lang. Well, yeah, because Cagayan de Oro is not really uh, that modern that time. So, we sometimes can date me sa car and then I just park it in a very dark area. So, there. Sometimes I I bring them in my house and then my mom's always mad like, who, who is she? Yesterday was different. <laughs> so, in Anna, and then there was a time... Uh, So I brought this girl at home. Naka uniform din ako magsaba ko ang tsanga. I'm not gonna tell you what what school. Basta kay pink. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, we we went to the house, of course, uh, okay, Kwan. So something happened. And then my mom went upstairs our house. She saw the girl wearing her towel. <laughs> Gamit ng towel sa mama. So she was mad. Why are you wearing my towel? And the girl was like, okay, I didn't know that this is your towel. So it was like, it was crazy like that, no? So, so there, I have a lot of stories, but what na? I've been like more five days. <laughs> pero isa lang yung naging seryoso. No, na, na ko yung mga na seryoso. My first serious girlfriend was Kato si Shari. Uh, then I had a ser- na, na po ko yung mga serious nga mga girlfriends nga, okay, for a uh, uh, few years or few months. Napo ko yung mga really serious, like, sa man, uyab ta or na? Are you a girlfriend? I don't know. Okay, let's just be friends. <laughs> so, sometimes like that. Or, um, sometimes it would like take six months, and then the girl will ask me, what are we? Mm. I was like, I don't know. What about you? Okay. You're my girlfriend? Okay, sure. <laughs> so, you're my boyfriend? Okay. Sometimes, you know, I, I had a really, it's not, uh, Usay mga katawa, usay we find it funny, no? Uh, I'm I'm like that, or some some people find it disgusting. Like ah, you're you're promiscuous. You're like that. You're a womanizer. But I didn't grow up with uh, I didn't grow up with a, a father, so nobody mm. told me what to well, do. Nobody like well, like nobody guided me. Mm. It's just my mommy, my lola, and my mama, my mother, biological mother. So they can't tell me what to do because they're both women. They're both yeah. female. So, alam naman, they would, they would tell me nga, don't do that, Lord. That's a sin. Why is it a sin? Wala bang parang tito na nag, no. nag-guide sa'yo? Nobody. No, no male figure in my life. So, I have to stand up for myself. I have to be, to be the male figure of our mm. family. So, I have to be, I'm the man here. So, inana. So, there are two females. So, what am I gonna do? So, there's nobody. Ang, ang mag... Uh, the people who advise me, uh, the male figures who advise me, uh, the older ones, are always advising me the wrong things. Like, look, Cloyd, if you have only one girlfriend, you'll be bored. You have to have two girlfriends. Like, really? <laughs> okay. So, I was wrong. That was really wrong, no? Uh, I'm sorry to all the, uh, the, all the, all, all of you, and I'm not going to be bored. So, Sensya na kayo. Pero, uh, I had the worst teachers, uh, the worst role, male role models before because they would uh, often tell me, Cloyd, uh, one month na kayo mag-on sa, sa babaeng yan. You should go to, you know, you should have another girl. I was like, really? I'll do that? Okay. So, you know, I was like 14 years old or 18 years old. So, I was like, okay. So, I didn't really know what to do. So I'm I'm always listening to the wrong advices, mm. and then I do wrong things. Gusto so, mo yeah. maging serious. Oh, I, I wanted to be I, I wanted to have a serious relationship, a uh, serious girlfriend. Pero I can't. Iba yung maririnig mo. Oh, because people are like that. You know, mm, you know, you're good looking, so you, mm. you know you can do anything. It's like really, I can do that. Okay, so it's not really a good uh, childhood. Well, well, it was it was good in a way, pero. When it comes to relationships, it was not really good. So, I, I'm not really proud of it. I am really proud because I had mm. you know, plenty of girls. I'm not really proud of that because uh, most of those girls, na pasakitan ako ba? Mm-hmm. So, mona nga, sometimes I, I meet somebody nga na pasakitan ako in the past. I was like, 
Should I say sorry to her? But a bit of, and, you know, she, she's looking at me like really, she's, she wants to kill me. <laughs> so, and then she has a husband already, but I really wanted to say sorry to her, sorry for what I did to you. But some girls, I do that. No? So oh. I, I, I uh, reach out to them like, hey, I, I'm, I'm, I'm really sorry for what I did before. I was like, ah, it's okay. We were young. And my okay. wife, my wife doesn't understand that. Why are you reaching out to your exes? No, I'm just reaching out. I just want to be friends with them. I don't mm. want to be. Uh, I I don't want to have like twenty, thirty women going. I want to kill this guy because she hurt me. Uh, mm. He hurt me in the past. I don't want that. You no. Know? So sometimes I like. I'm really sorry for what I did. I was like young and stupid, and they forgive me <laughs> most okay. of the time. Mabuti naman yung nakapag, uh-huh. ano, nakapag-sorry ka. Uh-huh. Sa, ano, sa nasat na, ano ko lang kanina, yung uh, una mong anak, si River. Si River. O sa, nasabi mo kasi kanina na isa siyang autistic. Mm-hmm. Paano mo na-handle yun sa, uh, uh, sa, sa kabataan niya hanggang sa ngayon? Kasi iba kasi mag ng bata mm-hmm. na normal at saka mm-hmm. may autistic, di ba? Oo, oh, it's very hard. Okay. Having a, an autistic child is very hard, especially we don't know what they're thinking. We mm. don't know what they're, why they act in a way. So I have to learn. I have to like research. I do some research. I do some reading. Uh, a lot of YouTube videos, a lot of uh, advices from uh, doctors and stuff. So it's very hard. No? So like, for example, say River, he does something and I don't know why he does that. So I have to get get to the bottom of it. Why, why is he doing this? Mm. Like for example, why is he banging his head? When I say, no, no, you can't do that. And then he bangs his head. I was like, why? So I have to like learn how uh, that river will not bang his head. So inana. So I have to learn that. And then river has his routines, for example. Where are we going? Seven. Seven. Is it? Eleven. RC Cola? Okay. If he wants to go to 7 Eleven, right after 7 Eleven, he has to buy a burger. Mm. We, cannot, we cannot buy pizza after 7 Eleven. He has to buy burger first and then ah. do something else. So if we, I will buy something else, it would mess up his, uh, you know, it would mess up his mind. Like, why am I doing Because an, an autistic mood, it has, it has to be routine. Mm. No? Uh, their minds do not work like ours like okay mm. I want to take a shower now after shower I want to eat so ang, ang autistic people they they uh, uh, they tend to have uh, OC kind of obsessive compulsiveness na, I have to do this I have to do this after this I I have to do this after this I have to do this dapat naka routine na, na siya mm. so I have to uh, I have to comply also with that routine so ano ba toyo ni Moriver? Huh? What do you want? Bad. 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 Ah, okay. So it's time for River to go to the beach. <laughs> so after the beach, he has to buy junk foods. After junk foods, he has to buy mineral water. <laughs> so okay, at, a specific, may... yeah, oh. at a specific, uh, not just any mineral water from any store, at a specific drug store. Oh. So I documented that in a video ko sa iya, na this is the drug store. River has mm. to buy there or else ma- it will mess up. Isahan. No, it will mess up is, you know. Ang, mag, ang mag-vary lang anak, for example, the last stop would be a convenience store. So, the convenience store, it's either he will, ang mag lang anak is what chips to buy. Mm. Sometimes cheapy. Eh. Pagka ugma, uh, the day after, okay, he wants cheese curls. Uh, that's the only thing that varies. Okay, like for example, today he will buy Coke. Tomorrow he will buy Sprite. So that mm. that's the thing uh, that varies. Tomorrow he will buy RC Cola. So that is that those are the only things that, that varies. Otherwise it's routine. Everything is routine. So I have to learn that and I have to teach my mother that. And I have to be extremely patient because as I have said before, when I was in uh, high, uh, grade school, high school, college, I was very impatient. Mm. I was pick a fight with somebody. Mm. No? So I think God gave me river to make me patient, extremely patient. So that's why when I'm driving my motorcycle now and then somebody, uh, and it's raining and then there's a puddle of mud, you know, ma- ma- kwansa kwa, somebody passes, uh, uh, drives by and maigo ko sa lapok, I was like, okay. <laughs> so 
I'm extremely calm. Why? Because uh, God gave me river so to teach me patience. Kaka na just patience din na yun. Dili ka I'm just patient now. Tomorrow mm. I'm not patient. No, patience all throughout. Mm. Mahirap talaga. Mahirap maging pogi. <laughs> Wait, kaya magkuhan. Magundan ko sa kong work. Sige, sige. Wait. It's brighter than usual The lights look unusual all the time I spell out the yellows and transform the green Here one. Hi, Dawn. No. You cut here na nang takitaske mong hair. Oh, cut hair ta ha? Kanang dili na char-char cut hair, kan tinuod nga cut hair, okay? Ang daddy also mag cut hair. So River right now, dagan, dagan, because we made this vlog, kanay kan, mm. kan River, it was suggested by River's mommy. So, yun lang yung mommy nga, you should make a vlog. So at first, yung kung, no, 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 I don't want to exploit River. So, he said, no, you're not doing this to make money, you're doing this for... Uh, the people for awareness. I was mm. like, okay, sige. So when I um, posted the blog, a lot of people uh, reached out to me like, hey, Cloyd, uh, I want to help reverse a young Juan, a young needs. I want to help reverse a medicines. Mm. I want to help reverse a young uh, pa para doctor. I want to help reverse a young uh, therapy. Even to the mga therapy center. Hey, we have mm. a therapy center. You want to enroll River here? We'll just... Uh, uh, connect to a congressman para libre. I was like, oh wow, thank you very much. So, those are blessings from God actually. Mabuti yung inka, inka, uh, outcome ng oh, uh, so, pagkablog. Karun, so I was like, okay, very good. So, uh, there was a time. Ayo, what do you want? Chicken. Chicken. Pusing. Seven yan eh. Rice. Oh, rice. You want also rice? Okay. Like 305 in unboxing ng last day chicken barbecue. Fried chicken na 40 pesos only. Ay, dapat sila yung kuhan. Na ay favorite na chicken si River. So River only likes one particular fried chicken. Kana lang yung chicken rotisado. So, nabidyohan ako. And then the owner of chicken rotisado was very happy. I was like, thank you River. So, nasa na yung soft spot for PWD or autistic children. And then they gave us a gift certificate that this is for River. And then they were also na shock okay. There was a kind of a little cash ba for River's medicines. I was like, na kahilak mo buo ko. Thank you kaya sa inyo. So I I bought medicines with that one cash. Ah okay, Cloyd. Ah ano ba ang pinagkakabalahan mo ngayon sa buhay? Uh oh. So right now, ah. I have this uh, advert independent nga advertising firm. Uh, ang gapa advertise ako. I I I make ads for clients, for products, for coffee shops, for restaurants. Oh, awaton. Sige daw, be. Steffi, maawat na daw. Sige ka. Steffi, mga ka. Gusto niyo maawat. I also make vlogs. Kung gusto nila. I make reels. I make short videos. I make graphic designs, posters. Sometimes, posters para sa abroad. Para sa mga Americans. Para sa mga Filipino-Americans. So, mora na siya akong bread and butter as of now. Because I'm... Uh, I'm an advertising expert. So, mogi na siya ng akong uh, expertise. And when I was in college, kaya mas common ko. So, before nursing ko, I nursing ko for two years. So, the nursing theories, balan ako tanan. No, di 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 liwag ko perfect. Pero balan ako tanan. All the terminologies when when I go to a hospital, ang mga terminologies sa mga nurses, mga doctors, balan ako. So and then I took up mass communication. So that's my, you know, that's that's my destiny, mass communication, mass com. So, uh, and then my my first expertise was advertising. Mm. So mo gina ako. That's you know I'm a black belter in advertising. Tumbaga. And then after that, I my uh, my interest 
through to uh, filmmaking, radio broadcasting, film editing, tana tana na dayon. So uh, uh, sa TV, TV, uh, TV production, dito na dayon. So this is what I want. So now that's what I'm doing. Uh, my this is all the application nga kung natunan sa Mascom. So well, that's what I, I do right now. And uh, na ami vlog me river. We have uh, river and I. We have uh, Kaning vlog niya, kaning uh, mga routines ni River. So, I, I document it. I will have a, a, a new vlog. Ang title, at sige, ito yung title sa kong vlog ni with River. What do you want? C. 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 More. More. Why? Halo. Halo. It's brighter than usual. So, River's beautiful strange word, world. Uh, because of the koan, kanang song na Beautiful Strange, you know, it's about uh, kanang what are autistic people thinking, mm. no? Kanang Beautiful Strange, I love that song. So, mo na nga reverse Beautiful Strange word. So, you grind it. You have to grind it. Kasi man siya maka-inom. Isiganahan mo inom o kanang one whole tablet. You have to grind it like this. Pagumanda yun sa gulat ng sugar. Tiba tayong... Gusto ba? Iba! Nye! Nye! You have to get sugar, ha? Oh, pizza! Why are you like that? Hmm? Do not bang your head. Do not bang your head. Hurot na akong money, ha? Do not eat that one. Dirty na. Hindi mag bad boy. Ha? Okay? Hindi mag bad boy lang ka, ha? Love man ka ni daddy, man. Okay? It's brighter than usual The lights look and it's fall of the day and then I will come up with another vlog in the uh, river stories. So, kining river stories, these are vlogs na wala na ko na, doc na document. Wala na ko na videohan, but it happened. Mm. It's, it, it really happened. Like, for example, there was a time na nag-drive ko multicab. My wife is in the uh, front seat. Uh, my daughter, Casey, was in the, the front seat also. Yeah, river was at the back. Mm. So, niya tumiyog ka ng kuwan, niya tumiyog ka ng, uh, we went to Malasag, and then, somehow, si River fell off the multicab. So, we were already in the highway, it was like, where's si River? So, nibalik mi. Kana mga ina na, it, was, it wasn't documented, but I want to make a vlog. Humalong uh, siya? Dini, nahulog siya. Nahulog siya. So, uh, what happened was, si River, nagbaklay siya, he, he walked from where it happened and then down to Malasag in a very dark uh, forest. <laughs> so, and he survived. <laughs> so, I magimo ng vlog. So, river stories. So, uh, we are also planning to have uh, an independent film with uh, Jam Magno. So, hopefully, guys, si Jam, he will be ready in August now. So, there. Okay, Claude. Uh... Ano lang, uh, parang encouragement mo lang na mensahe para sa ma sa mga tatay na nagkaroon ng isang uh, parang autistic na anak, mm -hmm. kung paano nila i-handle. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I will start with uh, this. I, we did a seri series of uh, documentary videos for a politician. So I we did a video for uh a, a parents mother and father so I we interviewed the father they uh they had a a, a daughter who has down syndrome mm. so the daughter died so 17 years old a uh, 16 17 something so I he was really upset because and he told me during the interview nga, her daughter was Although na uh, PWD, although kanang na ay uh, Down syndrome, na ay kapansanan, 
pero he accepted her, uh, his daughter na like a gift. So, ingon siya nga, Lord, why did you take my gift? No? So, guapo kay it's, it's a very beautiful message kay Even though kanang, uh, we are given children like this, autism, na ay cerebral palsy, uh, sometimes kanang schizophrenia, or kanang, uh, sometimes kanang children with no arms, no legs, yeah. sometimes children uh, blind or something, anything na ay kapansanan, they are God's gift to us. So, di, we should not say nga, Why did you give me? Sometimes I, yeah. I, I do that. No, Sometimes I, I ask myself, I ask God, why did you give me river? It's, this is very very hard task. But if he did not give me river, I would not be like this. Mm. No, So I thank God the river. He, he gave me river because it made me who I am now. Mm. So my advice to uh, fathers, to uh, uh, mothers, parents, lolas, lolos, nga, na ay mga special child, mga PWD, mga persons with disabilities nga, na ay sometimes ka nang, I, I went to the doctor a few nights ago uh, um, naglinya ang mga kwan mga patient so uh, reverse uh, pedia neuro actually I went to reverse ped, pedia neuro so to have an appointment so I I looked at all the patients there I looked at all the parents with their uh, sons and daughters nga there was a uh, in kung So, based on my nursing uh, background, I was like, okay, so does this child have a cerebral palsy? Mm. And then the, the lolo or the father said yes. And then, Louis kay ang anak, eight years old. Ang anak. Eight years Ka- Katatonic ba? Dili niya makontrol ang iyan. Mm. Kasi si River, kasi seizure na siya because of his autism. Uh, my point is, these are God's gift to us. So, take care of your children. Uh... Unsaman ng ilang kapansanan, whatever they have right now, whatever disability they have, God gave them to us for us to take care of them. Mm. So, ang ako di ay uh, kamanghuran, uh, si CK, 4 years old, na siya ka ng uh, GDD or Global uh, Delay, nalimot ko sa kuwan, basta kay, eh, delayed siya ba? So, he's 4 years old, pero na siya sa mga 2 years old pa mo, kuan ang yung speech pero um dili siya lugar autistic but he's in the spectrum mm. no so meaning kung in the spectrum meaning igagaw ra sila mm. no pero he is struggling now how to talk he's struggling how to communicate which is a good sign so unlike si River sa una dili kay siya maka communicate mm. no maglisod maglisod di ba ningon ka nga uh, you, you mentioned nga was there a time that you thought na, okay, maybe I will have a daughter, maybe that, mm. you know. So, it came to a point, na, this is true, this is not true, this is not me being hypocrite or what. It's a really true story. So, I stopped watching pornography. Mm. No, I stopped watching pornography, I stopped, you know, uh, the womanizing, I stopped everything. So, especially when I had a daughter. So, when I had a daughter, pagka four, four years old, old man siguro sa akong daughter, when, when Casey was four years old, So, somebody posted a picture of a beautiful woman. So, I was like, oh, this woman is so beautiful. Who is she? And everybody was laughing at me. Mm. And they said, they asked me, are you sure you don't know her? And it's like, yes, I don't know her. Who is she? Is she a vlogger? And everybody started laughing at me. I was like, no, I want to know who she is. Mm. And then, and they, they did not believe me. No, I don't know this person. So, this beautiful girl that na- I see on the internet. And then somebody told me, uh, he, he messaged me. This guy is married, by the way. And he messaged me, are you sure you don't know that porn star? He go, oh, she's a porn star. I don't know because I don't watch porn anymore. I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. So, she, uh, then she told me, uh, he told me, he's a very famous porn star. He, uh, uh, she, she's a very famous porn star. Her name is... Lexi Lore or Lore. So I was like, okay. So I researched about her. I was like, oh, okay. She's a porn star. So she has a, a lot of uh, porn videos. I don't know who she she is, actually. I just know she's beautiful. And then uh, he asked me, so that means you don't watch porn anymore? And my answer to him was, it's very hard to watch porn all the time. And I am 
changing my daughter's diaper. And that st- struck him. Ba, mm. Okay, so I admire you, Cloyd. I was mm. like, why, why would I be watching porn while I'm changing my daughter's diaper? Mm. That's very awkward. Mm. So that's what I tell other people, uh, especially if you're married and you have a daughter. Why would you do that? No, You have a daughter. You have a daughter. And then if you change your daughter's diaper and then you're watching porn, isn't that a little bit awkward? Okay guys, dito natapos ang ating show. Uh, the Real Talk, please follow, subscribe, share and like Pinoy Rap, Pinoy Rap, Real Talk Show. At Clyde, ito yung simple token namin. Wow, uh, sa Pinoy Thank Rap, you. Real Talk Show. You know what? I collect mugs. So this will go into my collection. I will not use it, but it, it will go to my collection of mugs. <laughs> Because I use this. So thank you, Rob. Thank you. Thank you, Pinoy Rob. Okay. Bye-bye. <laughs>